Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. How are you guys? I hope you're good. In today's video I want to update you about my Invisalign. As you all know, and if you don't know you can look back on my channel. For around 4 months ago I started my journey with Invisalign. Because I wanted my to, to be straighter. Now I am like 4 months further. And I can show you already and I feel myself some progress um, and I'm gonna just uh, show you so basically um, also my speech now it is used to the tray inside all the time I adjusted myself also with food uh, eating the most annoying it is when I'm at parties and I have to take it out to eat but further than that I just uh, got used to, to it yeah what can I say I'm happy about it I had uh, in the meantime another appointment at the dentist to check up and um, yeah, it goes uh, good uh, so far. Uh, I received my second box with uh, the next uh, trays, and uh, I feel pain when I change the trays. Sometimes a bit too much. But if I drink something that it's a bit cold, it goes directly to the nerve of my tooth, and it is so painful that I even get pain not only to these ones but last time for example I got pain also here to these ones but as you can see these ones from under don't need that much uh, to be changed but still I got pain seems that uh, the tray it is pushing them to, to, to move their position but um, I can say that I'm really happy so far about it. It is, yeah, uh, most of all when I see the change, it is like, wow, what something like this can do actually. If you're looking and if you're questioning yourself if to get um, to get the uh, Invisalign or not, my advice is to get it because it's worth um it's it's worth the money also um it might seem in in the beginning a little bit expensive but looking for what you get and uh, the result that you get it in a shorter time than with normal braces then i would say that it's worth so you will see pictures before and after And what uh, you still need to know uh, if you're having also Invisalign and you're at the beginning of the journey, um, you also get a kind of um, gum to chew it in between the trays um, in order to push the trays on the right place uh, on the for example this one the above one it will always tend to go uh, to go uh, down but that's also because of the gravity so from time to time I either have, have to check myself and either I have to do like this to push it or with uh, the kind of gum that you receive it from the dentist to adjust it you just have to do and then uh, then it's uh, done and you get also some kind of um, yeah kind of pills that disinfect the trays and you have to leave them in the water like 5-10 minutes I'm gonna show you how uh, 
I do that like once a week because you have to keep the tray between uh, yeah, 10 and 14 days so you have to um, see yourself how long you gonna keep one tray but in the meantime of course you're gonna clean every time the tray is after eating with water at least and uh, try to clean uh, your, your, your mouth uh, with money. The only tray that I'm gonna keep it is the first tray because that's the most uh, that's the most uh, uh, important that will gonna show me at the end the difference of what was and the result of everything and uh, that I would advise to you also but probably also your dentist will gonna tell about this and, and another important thing about this is to try to not let the trays uh, out uh, during the day more than two hours uh, because you need of course to wear them as much as possible uh, but when you eat you have to take them out so yeah around two hours a day you should uh, you you are allowed to have them out the only tray that i'm gonna keep it is the first tray because that's the most uh, that's the most uh, uh, important that will gonna show me at the end the difference of what was and the result of everything and uh, that I would advise to you also, but probably also your dentist will gonna tell about this. I'm sorry for talking a little bit uh, interrupted of so in English, but now being busy with learning the Dutch language, it comes automatically in my mind to uh, say things in Dutch. Maybe I can do once a video in Dutch. My Dutch is not the best, but you know, I try my best. Ik kan al de sommige dingen in uh, Nederland zeggen, als uh, jullie dat uh, fijn uh, vinden. So I think that was it, guys, for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and see you in the next video. Bye.